Hey guys, it's Live and Stock. Um, I just want to tell a quick Cadillac Ron story because I'm uh, just tired of being sad about it, as I'm sure most of us are. And uh, I kind of want to look at the glass half full, tell something a little lighthearted. Um, I picked something battle rap related, so hopefully you guys enjoy it. I mean, I have a few other stories I could tell. If you met Ron, you know, for uh, 10 minutes, you'd have a, a Ron story, or 10. Um, but my story is I met Ron in 2012. We had battled. And uh, after the battle, you know, we became friends. We would text occasionally. We'd talk on the phone just about, you know, every, every once in a great while about sobriety and life and ba battle rap, obviously. Um, and we'd go over our, our material we, we were working on. At one point, he was writing for, I think it was Reverse Live. And I had my King of the Dot Prove Yourself tryout battle coming up. And I was battling this kid named Tox Chemic. And Tox Chemic had braces. And when I was going, I was going over the stuff I had uh, over the phone with Ron and there's a line where I said oh you got to hook discount on some braces because your mom is a dentist and Ron uh, he's, he's always good at adding little PS's he goes hey you should tell him you work in Caddy's meth lab as Ron's apprentice and uh, I was like that's funny that's genuinely good I'm gonna use that so I, I threw it in the material I get to the venue the day of the event and Ron's there and I didn't know he was gonna be there so uh, I was like, hey, man, what's up? You know, it was a pleasant surprise. And we chat for a little bit. And then about halfway through the event, I, I try to talk to him. And he goes, I don't play favorites. I was like, I, I didn't think you would. And so we go inside. Turns out he's a judge for the battle. Um, so not only has he written one of my lines, he knows what I'm going to say. And he's a judge for the battle. Um, I, I don't, and it was great because when I delivered the line, I, you know, I got to say, uh, <laughs> Your rap name is Tox Chemic. You probably work in Caddy's meth lab as Ron's Apprentice. <laughs> it's Ron's Apprentice, and I pointed at him. You don't see it on camera, but, and it wasn't a crazy punchline or anything. It just added a little bit of fun to, uh, to the material. And I, you know, I, I feel like the decision would have been the same regardless, but at the end, during his judgment, he, he, he very coyly, Says like, yo, what's up, Cadillac Ron, Bikini we West Day, so uh, oh, yeah. 3-0, laughing stock, man. Glad to see him doing his thing. Yeah. Even though he knew everything I was gonna say, and you could very vocally hear him in the background during my rounds. Um, he was just super cool, super supportive. And thinking about that battle is actually double bittersweet because at one point you do hear someone in the background say That was Young B the Future. Um, that was his um, King of the Dot debut event as well. And it sucks both those guys are gone. Um, I mean, I miss Ron. I, I wasn't his best friend in the world. Like, I, I you know, we texted. Their t time between our texts got longer and longer. And it was really unfortunate. Uh, I got to see him at Battle of the Zay 4.5, and it was really nice catching up with him. Although he left early, he still killed it. And, uh, yeah, man, it's, uh, it's really sad he's gone. But he left the most interesting, entertaining, thought-provoking, you know, uh, catalog that a person could leave behind in the amount of time he had the spotlight on him. So, yeah, that's it. I just want to share that story real quick.